What's on your mind today? Like, I want to change, but I'm not particularly open to make those changes. I'm trying. Every time I get rid of one compulsion, another compulsion comes up. Are you yawning right now? You liked it? Me? No. That's super dangerous. Hey, my friend Sean here would like to spar. Yes, there you go. Time, I bet. I know that. Use your rage! If you hold that to your lip, it's gonna help with the swelling. Oh. Oh, uh, that's great. So, Shrinking, starring Jason Siegel, yourself, as well as uh, Harrison Ford. And can you give me a little bit about your role and, and how you're gonna just, like, wow us in this TV series? Absolutely. So, Sean is somebody who's struggling with PTSD. He's a vet, returned from Afghanistan, and he brought back some demons with him. He's assigned to work with Jimmy for anger management, and he's not happy about it. Because Jimmy is the kind of dude who will try to get a smile out of a stone. And Sean is a stone. But because of that, they seem to be good for each other. And that Sean can help ground Jimmy, whereas Jimmy can teach Sean, you know, not to snap and to get rid of that hair trigger mentality that he has. As you're doing a role as a vet and coming from, you know, dealing with PTSD, what were some of the things that you did to kind of like prepare? I asked people who knew what that was like, rather than just trying to make it work or guess. And I did some some internet research and stuff, but it's different when you actually speak to people. So I asked and also a lot of the producers, um, they wanted to make sure it was authentic as well. So they had people who I could ask questions to, and it was uh, a great resource took some notes and I did my best to incorporate that into the performance. Now you said um, Jason Siegel's character is trying to like make this person laugh and keep them laughing and you're stoned. So were there moments where you really wanted to laugh and it was hard to like keep your composure because it's like, oh my God, I, I, it's hard to play this character when I really, really want to laugh. Oh yeah, it was tough. It was really tough. I mean, there's so many comedic goats on this show, Jason being one of them. And I, got, I got scene after scene with this dude. So it's fun, but it's very challenging. But it also seemed to work out because the idea is Jimmy does get Sean to move a little bit. So if it looked like the corners of my mouth starting to, to turn up because I'm smiling, even though that's me fighting to be a professional performer, it's also Sean finally realizing what it's like to experience joy again. So I think it works. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like it's going to work. Um, I've been noticing a lot of these uh, shows are uh, the shrinks now getting shrinks. So um, what's your take on, uh, you know, mental health and, you know, making sure that you are embracing wellness? Well, I one thing I had to learn the hard way uh, after I turned about like 22, 23, I just started having like old man problems early, like my knees and back start acting up. And I started working consistently to make sure that I experienced physical health. And I got an older brother who's wise beyond his years, who was like, hey, are you doing the same thing mentally? And I felt challenged by that. You know, everybody gets a little defensive when they feel like they're, um, they have to do something differently based on something someone said to them, especially when that person loves you. But he was right, you know, and my respect for making sure that we are mentally healthy has shifted from an, oh, yeah, of course, to an active. This is something we all need to make sure we take seriously. You go to the doctors for a checkup. Why wouldn't you do the same thing for your mind, you know, for your spirit? Absolutely. I completely agree. I really appreciate you talking to me. Good luck with everything. I am looking forward to seeing Shrinking on Apple TV. Thank you so much. It's been great talking with you today.